Little Dirk on his Instagram story posted this. Quote, unquote, stop buying all this jewelry without knowing what you're doing. A lot of the shit fake and some is overpriced. Get one jeweler and stick to them. I'm telling you, y'all ass going to be pissed when the truth come out. Nah, for sure. Wanted to get your thoughts on that. Nah, for sure. I mean, a lot of these jewelers, like, they be janky, like, they be, they, they be buying shit up off the street, you feel me? And they don't, shit, they don't really be knowing, to tell the truth, they don't be knowing like what's real or not. Like, it's a lot of, it's a lot of fool shit that'll pass that diamond test in nine days. And them jewelers, you feel me, they'll sell that shit not knowing. Like, you feel me, that shit cause problems, like, between customers and the jeweler and the motherfucker that's selling it to them, like, uh, that shit don't be right. Me, I just got one jeweler. I only fuck with one nigga. I know he, I know he gonna get me right every time. But shit, yeah, he ain't lying though. Care to share who you use for your jewelry? Yeah, hey, I use Carl Highline. And why him? I mean, shit, I just know he official. Like he official for for like years. Like my OGs is going to that nigga. Like from back in the day. Like he good. He green. Now, what did he do for you exactly? What jewelry uh, items? Shit, I got my first SOB piece off that nigga. I got like three grills off that nigga. Lost every one. Uh, I got my YWN chain off that nigga. I got my Cuban off that nigga. I got like three buffs off that nigga. I had like, I had like two 30 pointers and I had some 40 pointers. What was that? Uh, that's about it though. I ain't really that big on jury. Like when I was when I was when I first started rapping, like you feel me, of course you feel me, a nigga, young nigga fuck with that shit for the image, but as a nigga get older and smarter, like that shit don't really matter. Like I'm on the bigger and better things for so I'm on some grown man shit for real. Do you think it also has to do anything with your brand or image? Like maybe Years ago, you weren't as known or popular, and now you are going through, you, I mean, you are moving up the ladder, so maybe jewelry isn't needed at this stage? Uh, it's not even that, because uh, jewelry was never really, it wasn't even shit to me when I was getting that shit. Like, really, like, all my niggas was getting that shit. Like, you feel me? I wasn't going to be the only nigga in my gang that ain't had no a piece of ice. Like, you feel me? I had to, man, like. We all had to look good type shit, like, you feel me? So I had to go get me some, some little trophies and shit too, you feel me? But man, when I first, when I got my chain, I didn't want no lie. I bought me a big ass whoop wipe, so you feel me? Uh, my trophy good for some time, but shit, I'm, I'm gonna get some more ice on though. Like when the time and shit right, like I, I got, I, I'm on a mission right now. I got shit to do. Like. Fuck with this real estate and shit, you feel me? Invest in these businesses and shit, you feel me? Fuck, I fuck around this other little shit. Once I got that shit in order, you feel me? I fuck around. And for time reference, it's September 2021 now. Mm-hmm.